Hi everyone, welcome or welcome back. My name is Candy and this is Stuff and Budget. Today is Mini Mondays and I am super excited, so let's get into it. All right, you guys, so today is Mini Mondays. I just love playing Mini Mondays, you guys. It just makes me so happy. Like playing all these games actually is so much fun and makes me so happy, so yes. All right, let's get out all of our things. Here we go. Okay, you guys, so last Monday, I did a little sneaky giveaway. I was gonna give away five sets of my Year of Minis digital download that I had come up with, and I only heard back so far, today is Friday when I'm filming, by the way, um, I've only heard back from a couple of people. So if you guys were a winner, you'll have to go and watch the video to see if you won, but if you guys were a winner, please, please, uh, go ahead and email me at stuffandbudget at gmail.com. I'll put it right here, stuffandbudget at gmail.com, and I will go ahead and email you your set of minis. If you actually already purchased them, I will go ahead and refund you your money. Now, if I don't hear back from you guys, because it's already been a week's time, if I don't hear back from you guys by, let's just say, Wednesday evening, I'm going to go ahead and pick a few new winners. Okay, let's go ahead and get into our challenges, or let's go ahead and start off with this. All right, so this is Would You Rather, and the question was, would you rather have unlimited money or unlimited love? I went with unlimited money because I feel like the people that are going to love me are going to love me, and I think most of you guys agreed with the answer. Uh, there was a few of you guys that did choose unlimited love, so that is all good. So we are going to put our dollar into our would you rather envelope. And let's see, we have five, six, seven, eight. Once this envelope gets to 10, then we put those $10 into our mini Mondays as a couple of spicy fives. But you guys, we are done with our would you rather. That was our last card. So I'm going to need to get a new game out for us to play together. Just a second. Okay, guys, so here it is. It is called This or That. Took me a minute to find it because I forgot where I put it. But this is from sofs.budgeting.life and it is some questions. So this or that, let's go ahead and roll and see how many the red is and how many the blue is. So here we go. Red is gonna be worth $4. Let me go ahead and write that in, $4. And then blue is gonna be worth $4. Let's go ahead and roll again. $3. All right, so we'll go ahead and ask the first question. Summer or winter? I am definitely a winter girl. I don't like summer because I can't stand the heat. I don't do well in the heat. <laughs> I'd much rather it be cooler weather. So we are in Southern California, so our winters are are not as like harsh as some of the rest of the country. So maybe if I lived in those areas, I wouldn't pick winter. But for me, since I live in Southern California and our winters are fairly mild, I am gonna go ahead and do that. So we are going to be um, owing $3 into our this or that challenge. I will cut this down so it can fit in here and I think I will have that ready for next time. So you guys let me know in the comments, what do you choose, summer or winter? All right, so let's go ahead and count out our money first. So here is $50 in ones, I'm not gonna count those, but I do have some buyback money here, and I am trying to do bigger bills with my buybacks to see if it's a little bit easier for me. Um, like my sister Karen does over at the Faithful Dash. So we are going to do 20, 30, 40, 50 dollars, and I'm going to put this to the side for now. All right, and then let's go ahead and get out our challenges. So this is my challenge from Stuff and Budget. What a bunch of boo sheet, and it is a bunch of different ghosts. Now, someone had said that I colored in too many ghosts, but I don't know if you guys can see, these ghosts are all worth different amounts, or just ones and twos. So these are ones, twos, ones, twos, ones, twos, and it is a $45 challenge. And, that was actually inspired by my friend that I used to work with. His name is Ben. He watches my videos. So hi, Ben. Um, it was funny because whenever we would work together or when we did work together, 
you know, some of the stuff that would happen at my work was a bunch of bushy, but he would always say, he would always say like, this is bushy, this is bushy, but you know, the real word. And so I thought that would be a cute challenge. And so that's what inspired me to create that. <laughs> so thanks, Ben. All right. Uh, this one is a cute little ghost and some spiders from Alley Bear Budgets. We only, well, not only, we need four, six, we need 12 more dollars to finish that one. This is a cute Apple pick and save from my friend Jessica over at GP's Odds and Ends. It's a save $50. And we just started that, so I'm not, we're probably not going to finish that. All right, and then this is our cute October challenge. This is from Cajun Girl Creates. And we still need a little bit of money there. Let's see, three, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, twelve dollars for this one as well. And then we also have Fall is in the Air. This is from Lady Die Saves. And someone told me that I messed up on this one too. But I can't see the number because it's in red and I crossed it off in red. So if it is not equal to 55 at the end, I will make it 55 at the end. <laughs> and then this is my Owl by Myself challenge. It's so cute. And this is from Halo Budgets. And we need two, four, six, eight, ten dollars to finish this one. So I'm not confident we're gonna finish any, but you never know. All right, let let me take a screenshot of this for my thumbnail, and I'll be right back. Okay, so let's go ahead and get out our money, and we will start rolling. Okay, two. I think I can scoot this, scoot these over a little bit. All right, so two is gonna start us off. So happy Monday, guys. I hope that you had a great weekend. And if you guys did anything fun, let me know in the comments. Um, my birthday was Saturday. I don't know if I'm going to have a video. I don't think I'm going to post a video tomorrow. I wanted to film something yesterday, edit it today, which is Friday, and then post it. But I just didn't have time. I've been doing a lot of things. So if uh, you guys... I think I said that already. <laughs> if you guys did anything fun anything fun let us know but uh so my birthday was saturday i'm not a big birthday person in real life i like to celebrate with you guys and do little giveaways for my birthday but in real life i'm not really a big like oh it's my birthday let's have a party type of person so we just went out to dinner and when i say we it was just me my husband and my five children <laughs> so weird saying five kids I don't know if, I don't think I put the, the $2 there. And then my oldest son, Nathan, his girlfriend, Nikki, uh, came with us as well. So it was just us. We went to a place called Shogun's. It is like a teppan grill where they, you know, cook the food in front of you and all of that good stuff. I figured it was a good place so that my kids, the younger ones, would be entertained. And they totally were. Like, Cruz was mesmerized by the guy cooking and chopping up the food and the fire and all that kind of stuff. My daughter, Cora, loved that little tofu miso onion soup. I don't know if it's miso soup, but it has the chopped up tofu in there and everything. I got her extra tofu. and She ate her bowl and my bowl, so that was good. And then um, the kids, I'm, actually all of them loved that soup. And then the kids loved the fried rice. So that was yummy. And then at work, my coworker, the one that... Um, took Ben's place. He actually surprised me and decorated my office and put balloons up. And um, he got Del Taco for lunch for like, you know, a bunch of people to join us. But it was funny because it was like a bunch of bean and cheese red burritos and tacos. And I love Taco Bell. It's a different, I think, genre of Mexican food in itself, or I don't know what the word is, but you know what I mean. There's like the authentic Mexican food, and then there's like Taco Bell and Del Taco. I love them both. Just depends what I'm in the mood for. But let me know. Do you guys like Taco Bell, Del Taco food, or are you guys like, no? <laughs> but anyways, so he did that for me, which was super funny because I told him like, I don't want to do anything for my birthday. I'm not like a big, you know, I don't want people like coming over all day and saying happy birthday to me. I'm just not that kind of a person. And yeah, he didn't listen, but, uh, but it, it turned out good. And then another coworker, she makes like the best cakes. She made me a really yummy marble cake with cookies and, or not cookies and cream, with like a banana pudding filling. 
and um, her frosting is like that whipped cream frosting, so it's really good. Um, buttercream, I can't do. It's just way too sweet for me. So I love her cakes because she uses that good like whipped cream frosting. So yeah, and then, um, you know, a bunch of different departments came. I got like a cute succulent. I got um, some flowers. I got a candle and it was just very sweet. I got a gift card, a couple of gift cards. And um, so yeah, it was really, it was really nice. It turned out really good. So I did that. Oh, and then uh, my coworker, he bought me like breakfast in the morning from IHOP. It was like a chocolate chip pancake, a um, couple of eggs, a piece of bacon and a piece of sausage. So I ate that in the morning. I was totally full, but then I ate a taco and a burrito, you guys, at lunch. And that just made me really full. And then we went to dinner. So yeah, I just feel like a stuffed pig right now. <laughs> but um, but yeah, I'm like so full. Anyways, let's get started. So in our owl by myself, we only have one, two, three, four. And let's go ahead and cross these guys off. So one, two, three, and four. And I need my buyback money, right guys? Let's put this away. All right, here is my buyback money. I already counted it with you guys. So I'll just put it here. I hope you can see that. Why don't we move those? Okay, I don't know if that helps or if that's any better, but all right, so let's see how much we have in here all together. We have five, 10, 11, 12, 13, $14 in our owl by myself. So cute. All right. Let's put that there. Next up, well, we got quite a lot in our Fall is in the Air Challenge from Lady Die Saves. We've got, um, okay, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. 16 17 18 dollars guys that is a lot 18 dollars let's go ahead and see which ones we are going to cross off so let me focus here <laughs> my eyeballs need to find the numbers so 18 dollars we have 5 10 plus 4 is 14 and then another 4 is 18 so there we go super cute Let's see how much we have all together now. Whoa. Um, all right. All right, 10, 25, 30, 1, 2, 3, and 4. And $34, and this is a $55 challenge, so we have another $20-ish to go in that one. Okie dokie. Next up, this is from, oh my gosh, look at only $2, you guys. And so this is from Cajun Girl Creek 8s. And we're going to cross off, we'll just cross off this little dog dressed up here. And why, why am I going to do this, you guys? <laughs> we're going to cross this one off for $2. Okay, so let's see how much we have all together now. 10, 15, 20. 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26. So we have $26. Let's go ahead and put these back. Grab a 20, oops, 25 and six. All right. Wow, only $2 in that one today, guys. Okay, next up, this is our Apple Pick and Save. Okay, so let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten dollars. So here's our ten. Let's go ahead and cross off. Let's do seven. That's the next largest one. And the three. There we go. Super cute. And let's see how much we have all together now. We have 10, 15, 25, 26, 27, 28. So let's go ahead and put two fives back for a 10. And there we go. Okie dokie. Next up is our cute little ghost challenge. This is from Ali Bear Budgets. And we have 
1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So let's put that back and we'll grab two fives and then we will cross off two, four, six, eight, ten. Ah, we only have one more spider to color in and we are done. What a bunch of bushy. <laughs> All right, you know what? I'm just going to play the way we're going to play and that is okay. So let me get out my black marker. Where is it? Okay, it just disappeared all of a sudden. Hmm, I think someone stole my Sharpie, guys. All right, let's just go ahead and use this. Okay, so 10. So let's color in all but one spider. All right, I almost colored in all the spiders, you guys. <laughs> let's see how much we have all together now. 10, 25, $30. So cute. All right, and then last but not least, what a bunch of boo sheet. We have one, two, three, four, five, and six dollars, guys. So here's six dollars, and let's see. We are going to do, hmm, let me get my markers out. We are doing blue and pink. All right, I think it's these two. I don't know. All right, so let's see. I've never seen a diamond in the flesh. I cut my teeth on wedding rings in the movies. And I'm not proud of my address. In a torn up town, no postcode envy. But every song's like gold teeth breakers, tripping in the bathroom, bloodstains, fall downs, trash in the hotel room. We don't care. We're driving Cadillacs in our dreams, but everybody's like Chris Down, Maybach, diamonds on your timepiece, jet planes, islands, tigers on a gold leash, we don't care. We aren't caught up in your love affair, and we'll never be royals, royals. It don't run in our blood, that kind of love just ain't for us. We crave a different kind of buzz, let me be your ruler, ruler. You can call me Queen Bee, and baby I'll rule, I'll rule, I'll rule, I'll rule. Let me live that fantasy. Yay! <laughs> Do you guys even know that song? I was contemplating on doing it, but I'm like, I think people will know that, right? All right, so let's see, $25, $26, and I'm not gonna put that back in the cash tray. I need to put it in my envelope. All right, you guys, so that is it for our mini Mondays, super fun. Let me know in the comments, again, if you like summer or winter, and I guess, yeah, let me know where you guys live too, or like the state, you know, so we have an idea of like what kind of weather you guys have to endure. I know there's a few people here in Southern California, um, but a lot of you guys are out like in the Midwest and in those states that get pretty snowy and cold. So let me know and I will see what you guys say. <laughs> All right. And we need our money envelope. Where is my, hmm, we didn't finish any today. I don't know where my other envelope went. I will find it. How did I do that? How did I misplace it? Oh, here it is. It is hiding here. There we go. So I will get this put together for next time. And let's put this money away. All right, you guys, I have some fun things coming to the shop. I'm super excited about it. Uh, I know I've had a lot of people reaching out asking me if I'm going to be restocking the icy blue and icy pink in these binders. The answer is yes. I already had my order placed. I'm just waiting for everything to arrive, which can kind of take um, several weeks sometimes. I'm hoping to have them in the next three to four weeks. And I also have some new colors, you guys. I'm so excited about it. I can't wait to show you guys, but yeah. So I'm going to have some new colors of these. I'm gonna be restocking the ones that sold out and I'm just so excited. I do have some new colors of A5s coming as well and I was so excited. I'll just give you guys a little snippet of it, but I got some red A5s. A lot of you guys were messaging me and asking me when I launched my red A6s if I was going to have any red A5s. 
and I had said honestly because I didn't think that they made them but I never saw an A5 red binder before but I found them and they are coming they should be here soon I will definitely let, let you guys know when I have them and list them because we are coming to that time at the end of the year where people are refreshing their binders getting new binders and all of that good stuff so as soon as I get them in and check them out I will let you guys know but anyways, thank you guys for hanging out with me. I hope your guys' week is off to a great start. Let's get Monday over with and on to the rest of the week. I hope you guys have a great rest of your morning, day, night, whenever it is that you're watching this. And I will see you tomorrow for tacos and vacation. Bye!